Imagine a jet engine powered not by jet fuel, but by a nuclear reactor. In the 1950s and 60s, during the Cold War, the United States Air Force and the Atomic Energy Commission teamed up on a wild idea, the Aircraft Nuclear Propulsion Project. At a test site in the deserts of southern Idaho, engineers actually built and tested a working nuclear jet engine. Instead of burning fuel, air was sucked in, blasted directly through a superheated nuclear reactor core, and expelled at high speed for thrust. The idea was simple, create bombers that could stay in the air for days or even weeks without refueling. In theory, they'd be unstoppable. But in practice, the engines work a little too well. They spewed radiation out the exhaust, meaning any flight path would leave a trail of fallout across the country. The project consumed billions of dollars, and despite years of experiments, including two full-scale reactors in Idaho that actually ran jet engines, the risks were just too catastrophic. By 1961, President Kennedy shut the whole thing down. So yes, America really built a nuclear jet engine. It flew only in test stands, never in the sky. And maybe that's for the best. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, follow, subscribe, and share for more medical and science madness. This is Dr. Pox, where the truth is stranger than fiction.